have the luxury, and I mean luxury today, of an air-conditioned broadcast location. If not, it would be brutal out there, and it is for this sellout crowd. Hopefully the soccer will make up for it, as Mateus made a strong run to the edge of the box, brought down rather hard, and Mateus slow to get up, grasping his right ankle. Play goes on to the midfield. I think his shot was blocked there. Mateus has had a good chance, took the shot, but it was well blocked, and he's hurt his ankle. Thomas Hassler on the right wing, looking for Klinsmann, he's got it, open net, and he missed it. It was cleared out, but Klinsmann's shot was off the mark. And now an offside flag is up on the near side, or is it not an offside flag? No, it was onside, they've given goal kick. What a chance for Klinsmann there. It's a brilliant near post run by Klinsmann. He's dangerous again, going in there in front of the goalkeeper. The touch was just a little overdone. In fact, I think the goalkeeper might have clipped his ankle and took him off balance. Yes, he did. Otherwise, it might have been the first one. Klinsmann stumbling toward the end line. Had to get that off. The Koreans with five players with one yellow card in this, the final game. And a missed opportunity there as Jung by Park overran the ball. Now the Germans head man it. Play it wide to the near side. Thomas Hassler. Hassler looking for Klinsmann. Ever aware of his presence. Klinsmann with a turn. Scores! What a goal! has got a lot of space on the right side and Klinsmann's come into the box but he's, he's got it away from the goal but he flicks it up in order to enable him to turn quicker and a brilliant, brilliant goal on the turn Klinsmann flicks it up to make it easier for himself so he can turn on it and hook it in brilliant goal that's why Klinsmann's Klinsmann Jurgen Klinsmann and look at the reaction on the German bench as Klinsmann in the 12th minute has given Germany a 1-0 lead here at Dallas against South Korea and stunned on the play was defender number two John Sun Sung for must play the ball if he, the players aren't able to run now across from midfield Klinsmann out of scoring range certainly here getting possession back on the throw-in. Hey, hey, hey! hey, hey. Klinsman shouting out instructions, you could hear it. Now Buchwald, and the shot hits the post, rebound! Reid scores! thing and he was first to it it was almost a half-hearted attempt to keep the ball in play and, but Riedler got the lucky bounce and Germany now looking very comfortable you see isolation there on Buchwald then the shot off the post as Choi the keeper struggles to find it no problem for Karl Heinz Riedler match to turn a loss into a tie it had never happened before and the Koreans did it against Spain but uh, Spain is not Germany not by any stretch. Participating in bringing you today's game is Gillette Sensor and the Gillette Series. Gillette, the best a man can get. And by Fuji Film. Fuji, a new way of seeing things. This segment of the game is presented commercial free by MasterCard. Thomas Hassler with the ball now for Germany on the free kick. The shots relatively even. Germany with a 7-6 edge so far here in the 37th minute. The cross. Riedler running onto it. Here's Klinsmann. Scores!
Well, Cl Klinsmann here, the moves he's making uh, are causing some real concern there uh, for the Koreans, but um, I'm a, I don't think Choi, the Korean goalkeeper, is going to be at all happy with this. Klinsmann putting it on the ground, certainly within Choi's range, and it did not have a lot of pace on it, this shot, Ron. No, but look, look at the way, look at the way Klinsman moves. He's looking for only a yard there. He's moving behind the, the defender. He comes in front, moves back again behind, and then at the critical moment, he's back in front and manages to get the ball and get another shot in. Jurgen Klinsman has now passed his goal total of the last World Cup. He had three in Italia 90. That was his fourth. He takes over the goal-scoring lead in this tournament.